The Supreme Court of Alabama is the highest court in the state of Alabama. The court consists of a Chief Justice and eight Associate Justices. Each Justice is elected in partisan elections for staggered six-year terms. The Supreme Court is housed in the Heflin Torbett Judicial Building in downtown Montgomery, Alabama. The Governor of Alabama may fill vacancies when they occur for the remainder of unexpired terms. The current partisan lineup for the court is all Republican. There is no specific limitation on the number of terms to which a member may be elected. However, the state constitution under Amendment 328, adopted in 1973, prohibits any member from seeking election once they have attained the age of 70 years. This amendment would have prohibited then Chief Justice Roy Moore from seeking re-election in 2018. However, on April 26, 2017, Moore announced his intent to run for the United States Senate seat formerly held by United States Attorney General Jeff Sessions, and resigned from the court. History The Supreme Court of Alabama was organized under the governorship of William Wyatt Bibb, and had its beginnings with the Alabama Constitution of 1819, which stated that until the General Assembly deemed otherwise, the functions of the Supreme Court would be handled by the judges of the Alabama Circuit Courts. The Circuit Judges were elected by a joint vote of both houses of the Alabama Legislature. These judges met in May 1820 in the capital city of Cahaba for the first term of the Supreme Court. Clement Coma Clay was appointed by the other judges as the first Chief Justice of the Court. Following his resignation in 1823, he was succeeded by Abner Smith Lipscomb. The court was then reorganized in 1832. It then became a separate court with three justices elected to six year terms. Abner Lipscomb remained as Chief Justice. In 1851, the number of justices was increased to five. In 1853 the membership of the court was reduced to three again. By this time the court had its own chambers in the newly completed Alabama state capitol. No changes to the court occurred during the years of the Civil War. The new state constitution of 1868, drafted during the Reconstruction era, committed the election of the three justices to the people rather than the legislature. The number of justices was increased to four in 1889. 1891 saw the number increased to five. Following the adoption of the 1901 Constitution, the 1903 session of the legislature raised the number of justices to seven. In 1940 the Supreme Court moved from the Capitol Building to 445 Dexter Avenue. The building had been built as a Scottish Rite Temple in 1926 but was sold to the state during the financially difficult years of the Great Depression. The state acquired and started a remodel of the building in 1938 for the relocation of the Judicial Department, Attorney General and State Law Library. Legislative Act No. 602, 1969 Alabama Acts was passed during regular session of 1969. It increased the number of Associate Justices to eight, bringing the number of Court Justices to the configuration that remains today. Former Justice Janie L. Shaws was the first of six women to serve on the Court. She was elected to the court in 1974. The first of three blacks to serve on the court was former Justice Oscar W. Adams, Jr., who in 1980 was initially appointed by then-Governor Fobb James to serve the remainder of an unexpired term. Justice Adams would become the first black elected to the court when he was elected two years later to serve a full six-year term. The court moved to the new Heflin Torbett Judicial Building at 300 Dexter Avenue in 1994. Jurisdiction The Supreme Court of Alabama has the authority to review decisions by all the lower courts of the state and the authority to determine certain legal matters over which no other court has jurisdiction. It further has the authority to issue any necessary orders to carry out the general superintendence of the unified judicial system of Alabama. It has exclusive jurisdiction over all appeals in disputes exceeding $50,000, as well as appeals from the Alabama Public Service Commission. The Chief Justice also serves as the administrative head of the Alabama judicial system. The court makes all rules governing administration, practice, and procedure for all Alabama courts. The exercise of this authority eliminates technicalities which usually cause delays in trial courts and reversals in appellate courts. Chief Justices 
The Alabama Supreme Court has had an unusually high turnover in the Chief Justice position going back to October, 1995. Since then the post will have been occupied by eight different individuals for nine different time periods. Not one of these individuals has completed an entire term of six years. Perry Hooper Sr. 1995 assumed the office in October, 1995 after a protracted election contest that prevented him from taking office until nine months into the term. He was succeeded by Roy Moore 2001 who was elected in 2000 but removed from office due to violations of the judicial canon of ethics. He was succeeded first temporarily by Associate Justice Gorman Houston during Moore's suspension but before his actual removal from office. After Moore vacated the office, the governor appointed Drayton Neighbors Jr. 2004 to 2007. Chief Justice Neighbors was defeated for re-election by Sue Bell Cobb 2007 to 2011 in 2006, and who in turn resigned for personal reasons in the middle of her term. Her replacement, Chuck Malone, 2011 to 2013, was appointed on August 1, 2011, by Governor Robert Bentley, but was defeated for renomination by former Chief Justice Roy Moore, 2013 to 2017, in 2012. Moore assumed the office a second time, beginning on January 2013, and was again suspended from office in May 6, 2016, by the Court of the Judiciary. This allowed Associate Justice Lynn Stewart to then become acting Chief Justice. Lynn Stewart became Chief Justice on April 26, 2017, when Moore formally resigned from the seat from which he was already suspended. This allowed him to seek election to the U.S. Senate seat vacated by Jeff Sessions, for which a special election was held in December 2017. Stewart was appointed for the remainder of the term by Governor Kay Ivey on April 26, 2017. That term ends in January 2019. However, she was entitled to seek renomination as Chief Justice in 2018. Chief Justice Stewart, who became the first female Republican Chief Justice, has been an Associate Justice of the Court since 2001. She faced Associate Justice Tom Parker in the GOP primary in June, 2018 and lost the primary to Parker in a relatively close race. Parker had previously lost a GOP primary for the post to Drayton Neighbors in 2006. As a result in November 2018, Alabamians selected a new Chief Justice when Republican Tom Parker easily defeated Democrat Robert Vance. Justice Parker will become the eighth different Chief Justice in only 17 years when he assumes office in January, 2019. When Parker becomes Chief Justice, he will vacate the Associate Justice seat he currently holds and Governor Kay Ivey will appoint that replacement. List of all Chief Justices of Alabama Supreme Court Clement Claiborne Clay Abner S. Lipscomb, Reuben Saffold, Henry Hitchcock, D. Arthur F. Hopkins, D. Henry W. Collier, D. Edmund S. Dargan, D. William P. Chilton, D. George Goldthwaite, D. Samuel F. Rice, D. Abram J. Walker, D. Alicia W. Peck, R. Thomas Minot Peters, R. Robert C. Brickell, D. George W. Stone, D. Robert C. Brickell, D. Re-elected. Samuel D. Weekly Jr., D. John R. Tyson, D. James R. Dowdell, D. John C. Anderson, D. Lucien D. Gardner, D. James E. Livingston, D. Howell Heflin, D. C. C. Torbett, D. Ernest C. Hornsby, D. Perry O. Hooper, Senior, R. 1995 to 2001. Roy Moore, R. 2001 to 2003. Gorman Houston, R. Acting 2003-2004. Drayton Neighbors Jr., R. 2004 to 2007. Sue Bell Cobb, D. 2007 to 2011. Chuck Malone, R. 2011 to 2013. Roy Moore, R. 2013 to 2017. Lynn Stewart, R. Acting 2016-2017, appointed 2017 to 2019. Topic: Associate Justices. The eight current Associate Justices are James Allen Main, Tommy Bryan, Kelly Wise, Mike Bolin, Tom Parker, Brady E. Menheim Jr., Greg Shaw, and William B. Will. Sellers. The current members of the court initially came to their seats via election, with three exceptions. 
Justice James Allen Main who was appointed in January 2011 to a vacancy created by the retirement of Justice Champ Lyons. Then Governor Bob Riley appointed Maine during the last days of his administration. Like four other members of the current court, Justice Maine had previously served on the appellate courts of Alabama. Justice Maine was elected to a full six-year term without opposition on November 6, 2012. The clerk of court is Julia Jordan Weller. Justice Stewart's elevation to the Chief Justice position created a vacancy in the seat she held. That vacancy was filled by Governor Ivey on May 25, 2017, with the appointment of Justice William B. Will. Sellers. The full term for that seat is up in 2019 with the election for it 2018. Justice Glenn Murdoch announced his resignation from the court effective, January 16, 2018 creating a third vacancy to be filled by appointment by Governor K. Ivey in just eight months. Justice Maine did not seek re-election and will retire at the end of his term in January, 2019. On January 19, 2018 Governor Ivey appointed 20th Judicial Circuit Judge Brady E. Menheim, Jr. to fill the vacant place one justice seat. Menheim was defeated for nomination to a full term on June 17, 2018 by Circuit Judge Sarah Hicks Stewart. J. Mitchell was elected to the seat being vacated by retiring Justice Maine and will assume office in January, 2019. Another vacancy will occur among the Associate Justices as soon as Justice Tom Parker is sworn in as Chief Justice in January, 2019. Former Associate Justices of Alabama Supreme Court partial list. Oscar W. Adams Jr. D. Renew P. Alman D. Janie L. Shaws D. John England D. Ralph Cook D. Jean Brown R. Gorman Houston R. Champ Lyons R. Harold C R. Patricia Smith R. Thomas Woodall R. Bernard Harwood R. Glenn Murdoch R. Topic: Marshals. The state of Alabama marshals are responsible for protection of the Supreme Court, Court of Criminal Appeals, and the Court of Civil Appeals. They also serve subpoenas and court documents among other duties. See also Courts of Alabama Alabama Court of Civil Appeals Alabama Court of Criminal Appeals <laughs>